This is a game that you can set up and play at home with a grown-up. It's called the rhyming game. You could do it on a tray or on a plate or like I've done here I've marked a space out on the floor. I have lots of different objects. Let's look at what they are. I've got a key. I've got a ring. I've got a bee. A shell. String. A bell. A goat. A peg. A boat and an egg. Sometimes words rhyme because they sound a little bit the same at their ends. Did you hear any sounds that sounded the same? Let's have a look. We have key. But key doesn't sound like shell and it doesn't sound like egg. What about B, B and key? B and key, they rhyme. So we'll take them out of the square. Let's choose another one. What should we choose this time? How about a boat? Boat, boat shell that doesn't rhyme boat string that doesn't rhyme what about boat and goat goat boat boat goat they sound similar they rhyme let's choose another pair what about shell. This is a cockle shell. Shell. Does shell sound like any of the objects that we've got in the square? Shell. String. They don't sound similar. Shell. Ring. That don't, They don't sound similar either. Shell. Bell. Bell and shell. They rhyme. That's another pair that we can put to the side. What have we got left? Ring, egg, string and peg. Which two sound the same? String and peg. They don't sound similar ring and string they rhyme and that leaves us with egg and peg egg and peg rhyme shall we look at our rhyming pairs again we had key b we had goat boat we had shell bell, we had string ring, and we had egg peg. Can you find any rhyming objects in your house? Bye!